Welcome to this week's version of Player Profile. I'm greeted here with Colin Claflin, senior captain of the men's lacrosse team. He's also an attack. So Colin, why Plymouth State and why lacrosse? Well, my original plan for um, post high school was to actually do a post-grad year and to possibly reach out to Division One, Division Two teams, but I took a visit with my father up here and it was actually a rainy, stormy day. Um, the leaves have already all fallen onto the ground and even still walking through campus, everyone had a smile on their face and the types of attitude that we got from meeting different people, from meeting Coach Webb, it was an experience that I'll never forget and it just dawned upon me that this was the school for me. Mm -hmm. So what are your personal and team goals for this year? Well, um, I th I'd say the whole team would love to capture that LEC title to finally beat Keene. I think we're going on 14 years without beating Keene. I mean, that, that's, that's a long time. And to be able to do that uh, is, is something that since a freshman, every senior has always talked about beating Keen, beating Keen. So that that'd be an absolutely amazing goal. I'd say personally, for me, is to beat Eastern Connecticut because they're the ones who knocked us out of the tournament last year mm -hmm. in the semifinals match down at Eastern, where we had a very very hot, hard fought battle with them in the regular season, beat them in overtime, and if we are able to go back and beat them again this year, that'd be a very good personal goal for me. Mm -hmm. Those goals can definitely be met. Mm -hmm. So what's the big difference between this year's team and last year's team, if you had to say? Um, practice, you know? Uh, showing up last year, I felt as if guys weren't too sure on their positions. They would show up to practice as if it was just practice, not as if it was a game. Mm -hmm. Where this year, the defense is pushing and pushing and pushing the offense, where now the offense is now pushed to try to score the goal, so it's uh, everyone is just butting heads. Not in a bad way, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, it keeps the competitive spirit up, keeps the comp competitive spirit going, and I think that's just pushing each guys to play their best. And because we have such depth, I mean, our defensive middies, uh, hats off to them. We have five solid defensive middies right now, where usually teams would struggle to have one or two. And we have five great guys that I would put against any offensive midfielder. Mm -hmm. uh, two and four so far, non-conference games. You got your LEC coming up soon. Mm -hmm. You know, I know you guys have a couple rain outs and snow outs, yeah. so that's kind of tough. But you know, what can you guys do to turn this around? Uh, we just have to keep showing up keep showing up to practice, I'd say a big, big aspect is the turnovers. Um, I mean, it's a lot, it's much easier said than done, fundamentals, just because as we've been playing this game, uh, everyone on the team for many, many years, most likely we've developed some bad habits, you know, passing not over the top, passing sidearm, shooting sidearm. Uh, not moving to pass and catch the ball. So it's basic fundamentals that I think we really need to hone down on and really focus on in order to go forward because I mean, you need to learn how to crawl, walk, and then you can run. So I think that'll be a big aspect to us progressing. 